Hi, everybody. Uh, once again, I thought I would uh, talk about something a little different. And I wrote this little spiel here a few years back. I thought I would just read it to you and the idea of this whole video. So this was one of the later rehearsals for the local play I did in 2013, so 10 years ago. The past year had been very depressing with my marriage breakup and I had no job, but decided to get out of my funk and do my very first play, which really helped with my confidence. When I first started rehearsals, I could never remember my lines. I, I haven't got the greatest memory. <laughs> and I always had to resort to reading my lines. I practiced my lines at home, though, every day, and slowly memorized them. Even though when I first realized I had a lot of lines in this play, I truly thought I could never do that. But I was determined, and I finally did it. The other male actor in this play, Jeff, told me later that at first he thought I was a bad choice and thought I would never do well, but he told me that he was impressed that I actually did it. So we did nine shows in total, and the best one was the final performance. And uh, if I remember, I'll have a link if you want to watch it on the... It's on my Canadian Stud Muffin channel. But in every performance, there was always a screw-up or forgotten lines, but even the seasoned actors screwed up. So it didn't matter, and the audience would never know when a line was missed anyway. Yeah. And I remember in one of the shows... Uh, you know, I had my lines to do, and I guess I, I skipped, like, a pretty big chunk of dialogue, <laughs> about 10 minutes in the play. And so the woman that, that you can kind of see there, she had to, I, I remember she had to run to what was su supposed to be the kitchen or whatever, and, and kind of, you know, the, but the thing is, the audience never knew you know, that they were missing a chunk of the dialogue. It was just <laughs> us. Well, yeah, I, even I, I guess, I didn't realize at the time, and she, she told me later. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, if you screw up a line or you say something wrong, the you know, the audience, unless they know the play really well, they're, they're not going to know anyway. So I'm showing you, I, I hope, you know, I'm not trying, to, trying not to make this too long, uh, I'm showing you clips of us in rehearsals. And as you can see there, I've got my pieces of paper because the first few rehearsals. And I remember the director saying, you know, you've got to put down that, that paper. <laughs> uh, and the thing is, how I finally uh, remembered all my lines was I'd come home and on my Sony Vegas video editor, I would do all the other actors' voices, so they were down, and then I'd be reading, you know, my lines, and then just slowly through time, I would remember all of my lines. And when I first did this play, I didn't think I'd have that many lines. That's why I agreed to it. I thought I was like a bit player, but I was one of the main characters, and I had a lot of dialogue. And so, yeah. Going through that, uh, you know, I'm just proud of what I did. And even my ex, I, my ex and I were, you know, on, on speaking terms back then. I, I don't talk to her anymore. I'm done with her. But we were still on friendly terms. And she saw a DVD of this. And even she was, like, shocked and surprised with my, that I did it, I guess. So I'll just play you a bit of the rehearsals and then a little bit at the end of the final performance of this. Mary, what's going on? We're dancing. Okay, the romance is over. Stand back. Brian, what are you trying to do? I'm going to dissolve that jerk. With what? Foot spray is fine. With what? Foot spray. Foot spray? <laughs> <laughs> so, so this is, uh, just watch the video if you want, but I mean the play, uh, it's hard to explain at all, but this guy, Jeff is a ghost that, that my wife in this play sees, but I, I don't, I can't see him. <laughs> How do you know where I am? <laughs> 
It works on fungus. Brian, all you're doing is killing your brain cells. Good, it will show you. I will, uh, you're fighting me. Yeah. Good, I will, I will show you. I will stop at nothing. Brian, get a grip. Never. Wait here. I got a better idea. Oh. I'm not sure I can handle much more. How, how do you work this thing anyway? What if there really was a fire? Fire! <laughs> That's what I'll do. I'll set the apartment on fire. Then I'll get rid of them. <laughs> The phone goes in a minute. Yeah, but he's got to see matches. Where are the matches? Yeah, and the director I had, you can hear him. He sadly passed away uh, maybe five years ago. But he was really good for me. He had the patience. And this is one of the later rehearsals. So I was, I'm, I'm starting to do, starting to learn some of my lines here. But I still got my piece of paper, you know, for security. Matches, where are the matches? Oh. This will do. Ding -ling -ling -ling. Answer that. No, you answer it. Maybe it'll bring you back to your senses. What? No. no there was it's too late. There was a knowledge. She, oh, yeah. uh, she shouted at you then. Yeah, okay. No answer that. Maybe it'll bring you back to your senses. Maybe it'll bring you back to your senses. Too late. Answer the phone! Ding -a -ling -a -ling. What? Oh. It's uh, Joe. He's uh, found an open tennis court. Good. Good. <laughs> All right. But, you know, I'd never, you know, except for stupid school plays that everybody does, this, this was my first time, you know, what was coming up was actually playing in front of an audience. And it was scary for him. Uh, you know, I had reservations and, like I said, not, not a lot of confidence. <laughs> Something Don't up here worry, but it's not we will get you through this. Just lie down and take it easy. When I get back, if he's still here, I'll look. In and I, w I will say I was confident that I knew, you know, just for me, that I, I, I could be a good actor. I've always, you know, it's, it's just remembering the lines, and then I'm fine. <laughs> the yellow page. I really need to calm down, otherwise I'll end up crazier than you. I'm not saying you're crazy, but i got to leave all my options open. Damn it, Mary, what the hell's going on? We're dancing. Okay, that's it, the romance is over, stand back. Brian, what are you trying to do? I'm going to dissolve that jerk. With what? Foot spray. Foot spray? It works on fungus. Brian, all you're doing is killing all your brain cells. Good, it shows you all stuff at night. So, I don't think this is with the audience yet, but it's a later rehearsal. And you can see I'm not, I don't have my piece of paper anymore. Way to go, Larry. Nothing. Brian, get a grip. No, never. Wait, I got a better idea. I'll be back. God, I'm not sure I can handle much more of this. No, it should have been you and me, Mary. It should have been. Oh, damn it, Peter. You are totally out of control, which means I'm totally out of control. Do you think I need a, do you think I'm going insane? No, no, it, it wouldn't matter. I'd love you just the same. I know, dear, but at this point, it's not really you I'm worried about. His ass is for us. Where is he? Oh, how do you live with this guy? Brian, put that down before you kill all of us. Good, it shows you I'll, I'll stop at nothing. Brian, stop it. There's no point in both of us going off the deep end. Why not? It will level the playing field. Damn it, how does this thing work? Stop it! What if there really was a fire? Oh, fire! That's it. I'll set the apartment on fire. That'll get rid of them. Matches. Where are the matches? Uh, this will do. <laughs> <laughs> See, I even make the the, the crew laugh. That's good. <laughs> That's it, Larry. Got it. That's it. Yeah, got it. Ring. Ring, ring. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm looking! <laughs> ding a ling a ling a ling! Answer the phone. Like, no, you answer it. Maybe it'll bring you back to your senses. Never. Ding a ling a ling! Answer the phone! What? Oh, hi, Joe. <laughs> uh, uh, there's an open uh, tennis. I've, I've just got two different. I think I had two cameras there, so there's two different angles. So this is the very same stage. Rehearsal. Oh, hi, Joe. <laughs> uh, uh, 
there's an open uh, tennis. I love it. Good. Good. <laughs> and hey, Joe. Uh, So this is, I think the, yeah, there's a, you can see the crowd, the audience there. And this is just the local theater. And it's sadly, because of fire regulations and all that, they, they stopped this. It's really sad, but it was only like five minutes from where I live here. What feels super? Oh, don't get upset, Brian, but Peter's massaging my shoulder. Oh, isn't that special? Oh, <laughs> not bad at all. Massage this, butthead! <laughs> Did they get him? No, afraid not. A little bit more to the left, if you don't mind, Peter. Oh, I think we are. Oh, yeah. Oh! Oh! It feels so good. You know, maybe a little neck massage is something you could use, Brian. It might calm you down a bit. Okay, that's it. That creep is messing with the wrong husband. I'll be back. And keep his hands above your armpits. I'll do my best. So, uh, were you really having a sex fantasy of music part of the human experience? Marriage, a relationship. So, so this is pretty close to the end of the play. If anybody's watching. <laughs> Maybe with someone like you, Mary. Oh, this is so sweet. So let me get this straight. Now that you two have met again, it's starting to rekindle something, huh? What the hell is this? The love connection? She's my wife. Well, it's such a charming story. An old love shows up. I'd love to see it have a happy ending. It does. She married me. She has charge cards all over the city. Besides, these two would right. end up. And then uh, I, I like this part here, uh, and, you know, because the audience is is laughing at my acting, I guess. And so yeah, it just made me feel feel good. And, you know, the other actors and actresses, the other actor and actresses were very supportive of me. And uh, it was just a, a really good memory from just over 10 years ago. Very disappointing. In all the years we've been married, except for today, have I ever given you one iota of cause for concern? All I know is that I need you, Mary. Without you in my life, I have no reason to get up in the morning, or walk in the sunshine. <laughs> you can see the, the girl on the far right, she's not actually supposed to be laughing like that, but I guess I made her laugh. Or walk in the sunshine, <laughs> or listen to the birds sing. <laughs> Without you, I have no reason to look at the moon or the stars ever again. Because without you, nothing in my life will matter anymore. God, you're needy! Would you shut up? Hey, Brian, that's the nicest thing you've ever said to me. Very jealous. Very. Good. I better get to the salmon. I love salmon. <laughs> I know that. But I love you even more. Oh. So you see, basically, what we have here is a very solid functional union with a very beautiful woman that I'm just crazy about. You are some guy. At times I can be. <laughs> Yeah, so it's just, you know, when I think back, it's just amazing that that I was able to remember all those lines. It's and so I, you know, the other, you know, the the reason I'm doing this video is 
everybody goes through hardships and, you know, uh, marriage breakups, uh, breakups in general and uh, depression and everything. And I think to get out of it, you just need to do something. And, that, you know, because when I moved to this apartment, you know, like I said, I never, I never had a job. I had some money in the bank, but the money was dwindling, right? <laughs> and there was actually one month where the rent was going to be due and I didn't have the money to pay the rent. But then kind of a little miracle happened with some money from a, from a lawyer from a few years back, which was like a thousand dollars. And, uh, so, so yeah, it's, you know, you go through rough times, but you just have to get through it. And, uh, like I said, do something with your, with your life. Don't just like I did for the first year here, just kind of, I, you know, I did my YouTube videos even back then when I was kind of depressed because I enjoy doing YouTube videos. But other than that, I was kind of, you know, no confidence or anything. And, uh, or even now, everybody, even people you think have confidence, they don't. <laughs> Not all the time. Everybody has, you know, a lack of confidence sometimes. So, yeah, that's it. I just hope, you know, I hope this helps somebody out, out there. And uh, that is it. Thanks for watching. Please remember to leave a comment below and like the video. I appreciate it. Bye.